Welcome to part 7, which is round 9 of my virus blanket tutorial. Let's make it. Ciao friends, Beth the Thimblehooks, and welcome back to part 7, which is round 9 of my virus blanket tutorial. This is my big brown one that I'm working on. That will be, this will be for a king size. This is what we're working on. Today we're still working on white. This is round, round nine, but this is part seven. So what we'll be doing is continuing in this light color right here. We're gonna continue through the light colors. This is a four round repeat right here. And we did the first part of that repeat right here. This is round eight, so on to round nine. Let's get started. Again, this is really easy and it's gonna sound familiar. It really is. All of these rounds are gonna end up being the same. So I'm gonna start out by our very last stitch here. I wanna bring all this together, so I'm gonna slip stitch into my first five chain space. And there we go. So there, it just brings everything together, kinda of closes up that loop a little bit. And now, just like we did down here, we want to put every one of these five chain spaces right here is going to get ten double crochets. But the first one is special because we're going to chain three, and this chain three counts as a stitch. So then we are going to double crochet nine more times into this five chain space. So there I did once, and then my chain three space counts as well. So that's one and two, so eight more. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9 and 10. Now there's the first half of the very first corner. Okay, get my loop back on my hook. And we're going to just jump straight from our double crochets that we did here into this chain space, our very first chain 3 space here, and single crochet. Chain three, single crochet in the next chain three space, and chain three for the second time, and do that again, chain three into this space, or chain three and a single crochet into that space. We did our double crochets in the very first loop, single crochet in this chain three space, chain three, single crochet, chain three, and single crochet. We're going to keep doing those things all the way around. But we just came to a five chain space. So what do we do with five chain spaces? They always get 10 double crochets. So here we go. There's one, two, three, four, Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. See, this was the corner. That's where we started. Worked over our chain three spaces, and we worked into our our increase right here with its double, 10 double crochets. Then we have our chain three spaces right here, so we go right from doing our double crochets into that first chain three space with a single crochet. Chain three. Single crochet into the next chain three space and chain three one more time. And single crochet. Now we're back to our corner, our first corner, our first complete whole corner 
because we started at a half a corner. Each one of these is going to get 10 double crochets. So we're going to 10 double crochets into that first five chain space. One, two, three, four, Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Here we go. This is a five chain space also because we're at a corner right here. This is a five chain space and this is a five chain space. So go right into ten more double crochets. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, And there's our corner. Ten in here, ten in here, so a total of twenty double crochets on the corner. To get out a little bit more yarn here. All right, so there we are with our th chain three spaces. So we go straight from our double crochets into that first chain space with a single crochet. Chain three single crochet in the next chain three space, chain three one more time, two times total there, jump over here and single crochet into this chain three space. Now we're back to an, another increase. The five chain space always gets ten double crochets. So one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, whoopsie, still working on seven, seven, eight, nine, and ten. And that was the increase on this side. This is a corner. This is an increase. Alright, so we go right from our ten double crochets into our first chain three space with a single crochet. Chain three, single crochet into the chain three space, chain three a second time, and single crochet. Back to a corner. Here's our chain, five chain spaces. Those are the big ones. Those are on the corner. So it gets ten double crochet. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, and ten. There's the first half of our corner. And of course, there's another five chain space right next to it because it's a corner, so it gets ten double crochet. One, two, three. Four, five, 
five. See, he's still working on five. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. And ten. So there's our next corner. Ten double crochets in this five chain space. Ten double crochets in this five chain space for a total of twenty making this corner. Alright, now we're done with those with that five. So we go right from our double crochets straight into a single crochet here. Chain three single crochet in the next chain space. Chain three a second time and single crochet into the last chain three space. Now we're back to an increased spot. One five chain space. All five chain spaces are going to get ten double crochets. So here we go. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. a corner and this was just an increase. There was one chain five space right here so he gets his ten double crochets. There's our next one, two, three chain three spaces. We go right from our double crochets into the first one with a single crochet. Boom. Boom. Chain three. Single crochet in the next chain three space. Chain three for a second time single crochet. Back at a corner. Both of these are chain five spaces. So they are both going to get ten double crochets. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. There's the first half of our corner. It needs to be just like this one. So this chain five space is also going to get ten double crochets. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. So that corner is complete. Ten in here, ten in here. Ten double crochet, plus ten up double crochet, corner gets 20 double crochets total. Believe it or not, we are almost done with round nine. We really are. Almost done, almost done, because we have to get right over here to finish. We're on our last side. So when we're done with our double crochets, we go straight into this chain three space with a single crochet. Chain three once single crochet in the next chain three space, chain three a second time, single crochet into this chain three space. Now this should be, and it is, it's a five chain space. That means it gets ten double crochets. This is an increase. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, 
9, and 10. And there's our increase down the side. So there's our next chain three spaces, one, two, three of them. We go right from our double crochets into this first chain space with a single crochet. Chain three one time, single crochet in the next chain three space, chain three for a second time, single crochet into that next cha that third chain, chain three space. And now we made it back to, there's the beginning. We have one more chain five space right here to finish this corner. Chain five spaces get ten double crochets. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. But you can see that these are not connected really right here. So we want to slip stitch into the third chain to pull this round together. And there completes round nine. See, that was fast and it was so easy. And look, it got so much bigger with all those double crochets. Right, so there ends round nine. Starting to look like a virus blanket. Thanks for stopping by to see part seven of my stitch by stitch, round by round tutorial for the virus blanket. Thank you for supporting my small business. Please subscribe to my channel and turn on notifications so you find out when the next part is coming or what other whatever other cool thing I have lined up. I do have some other things besides virus blankets, so you might want to watch those too. But thanks for stopping by. I'll see you again soon. Have a great day. Bye.